You can look this up at home. The earth is flat. Did you ever hear about it? Did you ever hear about this before? The earth is the earth is a flat plane. Oh, really? Yeah, and it's uh, scientific evidence all around here. Okay. You can look this up at home. We have uh, videos. This side's different. Did you see this side? You can look it up at home. I have to take my life, wife to lunch. Okay. See ya. And I'll show Thanks for stopping. Yeah. So you'll be in touch with Dave then? Good job. Good. Thanks. Well, I'm finished. Aww. I came from work. I worked 12 to 8 in the morning and I came straight in. I heard that. You're yeah. awesome. <laughs> yeah, so I need to rest because I'm working tonight. Awesome. So, you better come. Can I keep this? You may. Okay. You may. Anything right. you want. Okay. You have Facebook? Yes. Okay. So Marilyn Felchy Cheat. Okay. You know what? If you go right on here, uh, okay. Uh, you can get me that way. Okay. Perfect. So nice okay. to meet you. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> okay. I'm very happy to be here. Okay. Good. Me too. Okay. I'm glad you are. you can look up and that's what we have uh, this display and the other side's different and that's 200 proofs he's saying I'm not born again Christian judge he, me he said I wasn't either yeah. that's all right you are not a Christian you are a false prophet go after the atheists So, he believed in uh, asking forgiveness over and over. You know, do you believe that? I don't know. 
Well, I think we do sin. Okay, let me explain my side, right? Uh, How you doing? Hey, I'm up. Adam, is my mic. Adam, nice. Uh, for the most part, yeah. I'm cool, really cool. passionate about it. I've done a few um, events with uh, Marilyn before. No, no, I, I've seen her videos now on mine, too. Things that around? Cool. I have my flatter shirt on. It's inside out, you chicken. <laughs> If you get one of these, you can look it up at home. Flat Earth, you can look it up at home. See you. All right, bye-bye. You can look this up at home. I have it all the videos at the bottom. Here, I have the videos at the bottom. You can look them up at home. I can answer your questions if you have any. Here, you can look up the videos on the bottom. And uh, it's actually true. And I can tell, answer any of your, I'm sorry. I can answer your questions. Here, you can look this up. Flat Earth? No? Okay. This is what we're about. You can look at videos up at the bottom. There's a, you can look these videos up at the bottom. It's true. Look at the pictures. Yeah. Come out here, buddy. Are you getting tired? I know. I just had some uh, a guy giving me refuting all the Bible verses. How they're that you know it's clear that it's referring to a ball, and it's like, I mean. Honestly, what kind of cognitive dissonance can you have where you constantly, like, dude, I, I, I didn't even bother even, like, I don't even know if that considered lying because I was just listening to him and kind of guessing him because there's no point. I mean, when it says he's I, yeah, I don't know how to four corners of the ball. I don't know how to handle all those things. I mean, I don't mind if you don't believe in, in God. I don't mind if you're not in, you know, if that's your thing. Yeah, but, but let me go. Here, did you get one of these? It has the videos down at the bottom. You can look it up. Excuse me. Perspective is something that you have to study because they don't teach us that in school. But why are we trying to convince people? If people believe it's wrong, what's the problem? What's the difference? Because what's the difference between being educated with lies and being uneducated? Because kings never wanted the serfs to read. Because an educated no. people... If you believe it's not, I Are you going to let me answer the question? What's the problem? Educated people are hard to control. They want to control us. We are controlled. Okay. We let them control us. But if we are it's smart okay. and we, okay. we say no, then they can't just reach into our pockets and take our hard-earned money. Yes, because you have tax to pay. Whatever no, you, you don't have to pay taxes. Whatever, Only taxes a, for 100 years. What did we do before that? You don't need to pay taxes. They you got don't rid of have a choice if you want to live in the society, or you go to live in the woods, and then you don't have taxes. Oh, but guess what? They are going to come up with this new world order. They want the whole world to be under one government. That's what the United Nations. You believe it, we'll that's what the United Nations is all about. That's why it was formed. But whatever we believe, things happen. I don't want to be lied to. But millions of people live, you know, like every day in life. Yeah. And they pay tax and they believe they buy things and whatever. And they suffer. You can't do anything. And they suffer. They suffer. I don't want. I don't think so. Yes, they do suffer. You know, one of those trillionaires could feed the world, and they don't. I know. I don't want suffering. But I don't want lies. Like I this. don't want it's our country like bombing this. another country yeah, because of a lie. That's it. Goodbye. What does it matter? What does it matter? What does it matter? That's what I get.
You can look it up at home. Now wait. Wait, your hair's out of place a little. I, yeah. <laughs> Marley, my name is Sam, by the way. Hi, Sam. Yeah, I saw, your, I saw your uh, video on Pennsylvania one where the, the kid was so interested, the engineer kid. Yeah. Yeah, I, I really like got captured with that because yeah. he was like really interested in learning. Yeah, about it. I was thrilled. Yeah. Yeah. So, how, how was it yeah, after that? Oh, yeah. Sorry. What's it mean? Richard. Oh, I like this. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Nathan Roberts. Yeah, that, where is that um, uh, the conference thing, the Skype? Where, oh, there, there's Canada, one in Canada right? just closed. Just closed. Yeah. But the one in Denver is in November. Oh, not, nothing like close to New York. Yeah, it was in the Calora Carolinas, uh, Raleigh, North Carolina last uh, fall. Last fall. So I don't know where he's going yeah. next year, but we okay. ought to have one. I know, right? Yeah. At least we got New Jersey and New York now. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Uh, that's why I wanted to come here because I wanted to get people together. Yeah, I saw one of the guys that was earlier here. Mike? Uh, I think so. Yeah, we're there. Yeah, yeah. I, I told him that it's in our community because we live in Far Rock Away. It's also a good place to come there because we have a new boardwalk and people oh, keep going Oh, boardwalks are great. Yeah. They're great. He's always on the boardwalk at Point Pleasant. Yeah, yeah he's the one I'm talking to. Point Pleasant. Yeah, yeah. yeah so, I was down there two days ago. I and we take the banner to Ocean City. We go there. Wow. So next time, go. Yeah, good. Next time, guys, go to Far Rockaway. I didn't hear you. What? Next time, go to Far Rockaway to our community. Oh, yeah, Rockaway yeah. Beach. Yeah. Rockaway. Rockaway. Yeah. And that's nice there. B67. Yeah. Oh, always a lot of people. Yeah. From we B67 should do that. To 90, yeah. You gonna help me get that together? Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. I already, um, what's his name, Daniel, I told him to come on Wednesday because we have like, every Wednesday we have a Christian gathering and one, one of our pastors still like, doesn't believe in this, like, yeah. I show him the verses. They're afraid, they don't yeah, want to divide yeah. the church. Yeah, so, I don't know what's keeping him, <laughs> so, oh. so it's, it's better to have more. Uh, from the yeah. people, so at least yes. he will well, what does the Bible say? Where two or three are gathered, yeah. there I will be. And that's what I told uh, Dave when I was down. He said, This is a lot easier with you here. I said, Well, two or three are gathered, that's true. and Jesus comes and supports us. So that's what you got to go. You got to do it's the plan. The there you go now because you've been here for so long. <laughs> oh, this come on, eldest. come on. Right here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but she's been, been sharing, so she's been sharing to her classmates about platter. Uh oh. <laughs> You go smart. You gotta be smart. I have brain twister for you guys. This is awesome. Your daddy's a smart man. Listen to him. No, I like I like it because when you're okay, a teacher okay. in Pennsylvania, you're like, you know, the lying to kids is child abuse. Or like, no, that's right. I can use that one. That's right. Because in the, in the school when they had a program, one of the principals said, "Guys, learn more science so you can be astronaut." But I was already a planner. I was like. Oh no, my if gosh! You only know, if you only know how so bad you can be a paid liar. <laughs> what? <laughs> Man. But you know, I'm like, if you're the only one in the community that lives believes in flat earth for now, it's kind of hard to stand out. Like, it oh, is hard. Yeah, yeah, it's like, I've gone out alone, and it's hard, but that's okay. You just have to be thick-skinned. Thick-skinned, right? Aww. <laughs> okay. Did, right, did you ride over on the ferry? No, uh, we went to uh, just take the A, a train. Oh, because the ferry is a good ride. And it's cheap. Maybe I can do yes. that. It's like, right? Yeah, it's yeah, yeah. like uh, the same as a subway fare. There you go. And you go out on the water. It's beautiful. Who is that? In 34? I don't know. I came up with a guy last year who knew the area. Oh, and he okay. took me on the ferry. And yeah, it was... Nice. I'll find out. Do you have an Instagram? Maybe I can have you Instagram. No, I don't have Instagram. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm on Facebook. Come here. Give me your foot. There you go. Oh, the Okay, no, What's your other TV? Marilyn Phil TT. Man, that's me with the curtain thing. That's me. Okay, I'm gonna add you. Okay? Alright, good job. Well, uh, you're gonna see it, Sam, uh, Samuel. My name is Samuel. Very good. Very good. Okay, good I'm glad to meet you. Take your girls. <laughs> Oh,
Research the flat earth. You can look up this information. Of the bike and the shadow of book. Look it up. Research the flat earth.
Flat Earth evidence. Flat Earth evidence. Flat Earth evidence. He's with us. Hi, man. How, are How are you? Good nice to meet, meet you. you. How are you? All we right. A couple times on the phone. Yes, we did. Yes. Excellent. Good to see you guys are here. Yeah. Get out there here early. Off. Yeah. I don't know how long we'll be here. Uh, this is my last packet of handouts. Yeah. I ran out of my cards from actually David Weiss. He gave me a whole bunch of them. But I, I'm out. I uh, told David I need more cards. I wanted to bring them down. Here. Well, I'll get them from Dave Gessner. Does he have some? He has cards. Oh, good. Good. Okay. Excellent. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I went out last night. I just snuck out. My wife and me. Ah. Uh, Walked down to the local bar, though. Yeah. And I just started hanging out. I said, hey, look, come down at Times Square. You know, meet some people. Find out, you know, that you live off the road. Sure. And just wake up. Great. Great. But I was there, too. So. Getting the word out. Just saying the words flat earth puts it in their ear, oh, into yeah. their mind. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, so, I mean, yeah. just... I'm just coming down here. This is the longest train ride I ever, I ever took. Oh, you yeah. brought the train yeah. there. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, I wasn't going to Yeah, we parked right the half block down. Oh, you found a spot? Well, we pre -rent, prepaid. Oh, oh, I see. Okay, yeah. we could do that. And, uh, do that. and Dave got the parking. I picked him up, and we came up together. Okay, excellent. Yeah. Oh, oh good. Flat Earth evidence. Look it up. Yeah, mentioning a bunch of old sergeants the other day. I brought this up with a couple of people too. You know, we have the one more, one more. Eclipse in the sun. Um, we cast in the shadow of 70 miles of the white across the top. And I've always thought of that. But I mean, yeah, you're right there within itself. It, it, there's, there's no way no. that a shadow is going to get smaller. It's no. gonna, if anything, is it going to get larger? And they say the sun, the, the globes say... The sun is 400 times bigger than the oh, Earth. Yeah, yeah. So that makes no sense. Those rays should be coming in parallel. Oh, the whole sky should be different. Completely separate. Yep, yep, yep. David, he would like some carts. Oh, yeah, I'll definitely take some You guys want anything? You, you can you put your stuff underneath there if you want. Or, uh, oh, yeah, yeah. What was it? Do you want any water? Or anything like I'm good. You're good? Yep. Flat Earth Research. You can look into it at home. Thank you. Flat Earth evidence. Flat Earth. Flat Earth. Flat Earth evidence. You can look it up at home. Nobody will ever know. You'll just be smarter. Did you ever hear Flat Earth? Flat Earth, look it up at home. You want to look it up at home? Oh, he got it. That's right. Do you have one of these? There you go. Oh, that's wonderful. Hey, it's true, buddy. It makes sense. It all makes sense. You watch those videos on there. Hey, come here. Well, here's one thing you have not seen. There, put your nose about like here. Get down a little bit. This is the sun. Did it set? Yes, it did. Did it go down? Visually, yeah. yeah, but it's on a flat plane. Now you do it. Nose down a little bit. Okay, ready? Did it go down? Yes, it did. Did it go down? Yeah, because the moisture in the atmosphere magnifies. It's really on a flat surface. It's going away. And you'll see that when you watch the time lapse video, you'll see it go away. And it's awesome. It's Look into it. I'll look into it. It is. Listen to that man. Listen.
listen to it. <laughs> Here you can look this up at home. This is uh, the flat earth evidence. No kidding. You want to do this? It's your perception of why you think the sun goes down when it really doesn't. It's the moisture in the atmosphere. Oh no, I'm sorry. We're looking at the boat? Okay. <laughs> All right. You picking up our flat earth girl here? Why? So you can go out with her? She's not a flat earth now. She's, oh. she needs her direction. She needs her direction. <laughs> no, uh, apparently this is it, you know? People that kind of saw your promotions or whatever threads. Like dozen, two dozen maybe? Maybe. Chris is a... Uh, Some have come and guy. gone. Yeah. So, yeah. And we're getting it on film. They're going to do a little documentary. Oh yeah. Right oh, yeah. <laughs> no, but he's got a camera. He's doing a documentary. Oh, sure. Oh, sorry. <laughs> but uh, no, he's doing a documentary or something. So, yeah, I think it's good. It's... I just wanted to bring the New Yorkers together so they could have a meetup and a bigger group. They came from a lot of places. Yes, they did. Yep. Princeton. We're going to be doing Princeton and... Wow. Yeah, because Wilson's Dave is from Princeton area Woodrow over there. Wilson's hometown. You know how creepy that guy was? That's creepy. Yeah. Uh, and then we're going to go to Temple because that's a public that's university. Yeah. So that's it's Philadelphia. Philadelphia is our country's first capital. Did you ever hear this before? Oh, you got a paper good. Oh, do you see that? It goes down. Did, did you see it go down? Yeah. Okay. Through. That's what the atmosphere is. It's filled with moisture. It magnifies. Replicating the atmosphere. So in our minds, what do we say? It's going down beyond the curve, but it's not. It's just going away. If you watch that time-lapse video, you'll see it. There's no moisture in the air, and it goes away. Here. Right? Did it go down? Yeah. The sun. Okay, put your nose a little lower. Did it go down? Yeah, that's, we see it as it going down, but it's really just going away on a straight line. So this is a perception. There's a moisture. This is a moisture in the atmosphere that magnifies. That's all this represents. See? So because the tube goes away, that means the Earth is flat? No, that means that we think the sun goes down when it's really just going away. Well, what about the rotation of the Earth when it's round? It okay, really so if you're going to ask questions like that, I have to start from the beginning and tell you what flat Earth really is. Okay. And then you can ask a different kind of question. All right, uh, probably a lot of time, but appreciate it. 30 seconds. I'll give you 15. All right. Come, come, follow me. Walk this way. Okay, here's the flat earth map. North Pole's in the center. Antarctica goes all the way around the outside edge. This is the United Nations logo. All these use the flat earth map map, but they don't put Antarctica on there. They do this little leaf thing. They don't want you to know it goes around the outside edge. If there is a sphere, it has to have a formula for how far out and how far down, right? We agree with that? Okay. Here's the formula. We derive through the Pythagorean theorem like that. And we should not see 60 miles away to Chicago over Lake Michigan. It's impossible if it were a globe. It would be down through the water we'd be looking. And that's not happening. This is reflection on a flat surface. It goes right from the water to the table. Is that table curved? No. If it is curved, you get a spot. And you can do that experiment at home with shiny glossy paper and a light bulb. Okay? When you watch this video, 200 proofs, which is on the bottom of this paper, did you get one? Yeah, I got one. Okay. You will have to study perspective. It, it took me two weeks to get this through my head. It teaches you about that kind of stuff and how your eyes work at a distance. So you have to study this. Focal pendulum is a farce. It has to be mounted, mounted
monitored by hand. If it were a true force, it would go by itself, and it doesn't. This is Antarctica. That's as far as we know, and that's what we think holds in the oceans. Why has no one hit the ice so, wall? Right. I don't know. You've been so there? So how do we, um, people have been to the Antarctic, yeah? So they've seen over the, the wall? Government, the, the, the government has the been government there. Has been the there. government has, and they have an Antarctic treaty. Did you know about that? Yes. I'd love to see documents on this. Here it is. Well, okay. The Antarctic treaty is actually a thing. You cannot go to Antarctica. You cannot study Antarctica. Yes. Which is why it's not focused on the U.S. Matches. You pay thousands of dollars and they hold your hand and that's escort you. It's an ice wall. Yeah, that yeah, makes yeah. it oh, more right, sense. Right, right. It's an ice so, wall. so over on the like other side, right. on the other side is all about NASA. Uh -huh. And how it's lying to us? Oh. What about all the other space here. organizations? Come on. That aren't based what in about America? Russia's? Yeah. What about the Chinese all space right. programs? That ever since the Antarctic Treaty, there are 53 countries that signed on to it. Uh -huh. We have not had a legitimate war. Are you filming us? Yeah, I am. We have not had a legitimate war because I have a YouTube channel right here. You can do it. Wait, can I say you can have this bag. You can use it. Yeah, I will. I'll turn this way. This is a public place, a place, and I'm protected by law. I can film you if I choose. Sure. Yeah, yeah. There must be a thousand cameras filming you right now. So don't try and get huffy with me. Yeah, I am filming. You can look it up at home. Nobody so, will ever know. So what do you hope to gain by speaking this truth? Well, because what's the difference between being educated with lies or being uneducated? It's an interesting thing. I think you should answer that question. Yeah, there's no difference. So the kings didn't want the serfs to learn how to read because an educated people are hard to control. I don't they want to control that. us. Uh -huh. And they're digging their hands into our pockets. So what does the government gain by perpetrating this lie that the earth is round? Control, money. Control. In what way? Money. Well, what, what would, uh, did you know the United Nations was formed to be our new world government? I'm sorry, how does that have anything to do with the curvature of the earth? It has a lot to it. They're fooling us, and they can rule us if they can fool us. See, they treat us stupid like we're dumb, and then they can tell us anything and we'll believe it. Because they know about millions and millions of miles. And they make everything sound... Yes. What? This model is factual and accurate in, in your mind. How do things like solar eclipses happen? Well... I think that the like sun, the, one last summer. the sun and the moon travel at different speeds. Uh -huh. Okay, so they eclipse each other at various points. Well, then that wouldn't make sense if every single day is 24 hours if they're moving at different speeds. That wouldn't make any sense. Why not? Because think of it, think of it this way: we'd have less hours of sun or more hours of sun every single day. And the only time no, that no, happens no, is during no. the equinoxes. The the sun moves at a different rate than the moon. Right. The sun. They both move differently. The sun ways. keeps going around a 24-hour day, somewhat. Uh -huh. But when it gets in on the outside of the equator, it goes faster. It changes speed. So, so the sun is changing speeds. Yep. Seasonally. Seasonally, okay. it changes speeds. Okay. And, um, have, you, have you done any research on yes. your own? Yes. Okay. And... Like, I, have you heard the, um, I don't know his name off the top of my head, but there was, a, there was a Greek study, and what he did is he took a pole. Aristosthenes. Yeah, thank you. He put it, let's say, um, in Chicago. I know. And then he put a pole right here at the same time, yep. and then boom, they were making different shadows. How do you explain something yeah. like that? Okay, so he went on the premise that there was a globe, that the globe was curved. Can we stand over here just yeah, a little sure. bit? Yeah. Here, you, uh, do you have one of these? You can look it all yeah, up. I, I all right. This, I mean, talking to you that to say the world was flat, I mean, I might as well say that this um, round was standing. Well, that's only because you don't know anything about it. Well, I, I take the word of NASA. I know, and, and they lie Obama, to you. What do NASA they have to gain lies. By lying? Of course they lie. NASA lies. Well, what do they have to gain by lying to us? Lying. You can control people. Okay. Why would they want to control us? 
If they can fool us, they can rule us. Okay. I interrupt here. I just want to say thank you. Hey, and Taylor. I'll, I'll nice see to you see you. Yeah, okay. Thank you very much. But it's nice to talk to people with different opinions. I'll say yeah. that. You know, yeah, they do this over in England, too. They call it Speaker's Corner or something. It's a part of the park. If someone was to tell me that the moon is made out of blue cheese, I mean... No, I think the moon's a filament, a negative filament. Wait, 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 wait. A filament. That's what I think it is. There's free flowing electricity up there. So, you don't think we've landed on the moon? We did not. Okay, okay. No, but see, I researched it for two and a half years and you didn't do anything. I know. Hold on. Because I'm about to debunk the fact that we did land on the moon. You ready for this? Right now on the moon, you can only see it with a telescope because the moon's very far away. So, when you look at the moon, there are actual reflective panels that we put up there to study like how the sun reflects and how different things And happen. how do you know that? Because I've seen them. I've looked at them through a telescope. Whose telescope? Like my own independent telescope. Mine. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No, I don't agree with that. Oh, okay. Well, then buy your own telescope and look. I please. have one, no. Like I said, do your own research. I like did. Like you're saying to me. I did. No, right there. Have. We've done our own research. I know. The world's flat. It's not the Well, you, then you know what you need to do? You need to go buy your own banners and set up over there and tell everybody we're telling the lie. By the way, by the way, I'm not trying to be rude, and I do, I, I, I do, I, Hello? like he said, I appreciate people with different opinions. Okay, but I'm doing flat earth. I'm just giving evidence, and if you want to disagree with me, go ahead. Go, where, go away somewhere else. I'm just teaching people what this is. That's gotcha. all. I know that he was here for a long time. Yeah, that's a good sign. And I, is that a good sign? It's always good. Well, I don't think so. I think he was here to mock because he's. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. No, he asked me about Aristosthenes. That's a simple, it's a basic question. Aristosthenes. That was question number one. I mean, like, everybody knows that, right? Here, this is about the flat earth. You can look it up at home yourself. Hi. See, it's too dark in here. Okay, we pretend to not <laughs> That has all the info on it. <laughs> yes, uh, I'm gonna head out. Okay. Got my two hours. Um, stay in touch with these people and stuff, and you're good. Yeah. All right, enjoy it. Columbus. Okay. Thanks. Wait, 
550 miles an hour in the same direction of a thousand mile an hour spin, are you going to make ground or lose ground? I have the answer. Anybody wants it? Research flat earth. Watch the video at the bottom. The video at the bottom? Yeah. Are you moving? Are you gaining ground? Or are you losing ground? I have the answer to that question. flat earth. Research flat earth. You can we really don't look at this at home and nobody will know you're even looking at it. I'm gonna be coming back. We're gonna oh. get some feet. Oh, get something okay. to eat. Uh something to cool us off and use the bathroom. <laughs> okay, I don't know how long we'll be here. Yeah, right. I don't know. Well you'll probably be here maybe another hour or two, yeah. maybe. You yeah, know, that's what that's what I'm sensing. <laughs> okay, um, good. How do I get in touch with you? Uh, Flat Earth BA. You have it, right? Yeah. Got, okay. Okay, wonderful. Yeah, good. Daniel Martin. All right. See ya. Flat Earth, look it up. Flat Earth, look it up. Flat Earth. All right. Hey, 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 you guys. Look, you can look it up yourself. Just look at the videos at the bottom. You can look it all up yourself. Oh, yeah. Floods. Yep. Here, you can look it up yourself. Okay. At home, you can look it up. You want one too? Maybe. You can look it up yourself at home. All right. All right, fine. I'm just reading it. Yeah, it's awesome. I've been studying it two and a half years. I can answer your questions, but I'll leave you alone. You can look at it. Excuse me. Here, you can look this up when you get home, too. This is pretty funny. It is? I know. It's awesome. Oh, you want one, too? It's real scientific. We get some scoffers, but that's okay. Everybody got here the first time. Somewhere. Did you ever notice how when you sit at you say that 500 miles an hour, are you gaining ground or losing ground on that spin? If you get one, you can look this up at home by yourself. That's true. Busy over there. Yeah. They're much better. Yeah. Yeah. You know why? Because people can't read too much. They don't, it has to be. Oh. Yeah. Maybe they thought the Santa thing was a joke. Oh, maybe too, right? And maybe it was too much. You're right. Yeah. Yeah, this is. Exactly I don't know. You have no, to experiment. You, said it, you were right. Because I, I do. You have to experiment. In our business, one sign works like magic, and you put up another one, and no one freaking pays it. So why did I think of that? I'm standing here all this time dead, and I didn't even think maybe it was a sign, and my, and my Santa hat. They didn't want to talk to a crazy guy. It was too scary. Yep. Hey, this is scary enough. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I didn't. Need, I need to. Dr oh man, I'm so depressed. I love the idea. No, too. don't be depressed. Shame on you. Wham, wham. No, I mean just like over, like you know. Look it up people. yourself about the flat Earth. All right, guys. Flat Earth, look it up. Something at thousand miles an hour, you win, right? All right, now let's do the race. Can you explain the curvature formula to me? Oh, right here. These are different sides. This is the flat earth map. North Pole's in the center. Antarctica goes around the outside edge. See how these use the flat earth map, the United Nations? But they leave off Antarctica. I don't think they want you to know. Here's the uh, formula, curvature formula, and this is how we find it out. Okay, there is another way of calculating it, but I don't use that. I just go by Pythagorean theorem. Okay, and this is how you figure that out. 
So when you're, uh, you should not see Chicago across Lake Michigan 60 miles. And when we take our banners down to Ocean City, we should not see the water towers in Wildwood 20 miles away. But we can see all the way down to the bottom of them. Oh, so it's saying that you mean it equals drop, so like it should actually be, there should be an arc if it, if it were around. You wouldn't be able to see it because of the arc. The water, you'd be looking through the water. Yeah. The curve. See, and there is no curve. <laughs> it's weird. Um, eight inches times a mile squared. So 20 times 20 and then times 8, divide by 12, you got your feet. So that's how you figure that like out. That. Now it only goes so far because you can't see like through the earth anyway, so it's, it's unrealistic. But that's how it would be. This is how you see. This is flat because look, on a flat surface, it reflects on a line. If it was curved, it would be a spot. And you can do that with glossy paper at home. You can do those experiments yourself. Yeah, but that just depends on focal point for, for that. This, this makes